I mean, I was so screening with him. I mean, and I also, I got the job working with Andy because I had previous soap screening experience. And a mutual friend of Andy's and mine, a poet, uh, Charles Henry Ford, would want to be classified as America's first surrealist poet. <laughs> Is that okay, Charles? So, anyway, Charles it was the matchmaker between Andy and me. And so Charles must have built, built me up really strong because by the time I was introduced to Andy at a, at a reception after a poetry reading at the new school, I was pretty much hired before I even knew that I was hired, uh, the way things turned out. So um, Andy said, uh, I mean, I saw this guy, he looked like some, somebody stepped out of a rocket ship from Mars with silver hair and sunglasses. <laughs> and so Andy said in his very wispy voice, he said, and this was a Sunday afternoon. He said, oh, when, when can you come and work for me? <laughs> and I said, well, when would you like me to come and work for you? <laughs> um, and uh, he said, how about tomorrow? I said, no, I can't come tomorrow. I'll come on Tuesday. I have to close my book, my desk out at school. So I arrived on Tuesday, and that's when this famous photograph was made of Andy and me by a, a close friend of his. It just happened to be, this was all pre-factory days, by the way. This is a building Andy rented from the city. It was an old abandoned firehouse, uh, two blocks from where he lived. So um, uh, Ed Waller, which was his name, Eddie, uh, took this picture of Andy and me. Took a few pictures, actually, and this was an extraordinary uh, moment. Uh, and he actually made copies of the photograph for me. And then after Eddie left, and I went out to lunch with Andy and another art critic and then she left and Andy and I, Andy took me back to his townhouse which is two blocks from the firehouse where I met Julia, his mom, for the first time and Julia, Andy introducing me to, Andy, uh, to Julia, Julia embraced me and said, you are Andy's younger brother. <laughs> I, got the, I got the blessing from the mom, okay. Andy was like, <laughs> thrilled to death, <laughs> like uh, the approval. <laughs> so then we, Andy and I went to work that afternoon, and the first silkscreen painting I made of the, with Andy, and I, I, he taught me certain things, how he was doing things, but I knew how to silkscreen, and so it was not new to me. And uh, the first painting we made was a Silver Liz Taylor portrait, uh, 